All right. This is a new set of uh, things I got to fix. Two uh, old Honda 90s. They're tra both trail 90s. They've got a 6 volt system in them. I know the yellow one does. Pretty sure this one does too. Yep. There's three different, there's only three cells, so that's 6 volt. Um, I have to get those charged up and working. I can get those working, no problem. Um, so, yeah. Can you get them fixed up here? Oh, it's off the ground. This is this too. But I'm trying to think. He said they've been sitting for a real long time, and you can definitely tell that 100%. Um, they've been sitting a real long time inside. It looks like because the paint's not all chipped and the nice leather isn't all cracked. The yellow one's in worse shape. The red one's in better shape. I'm going to see. Um, they seem like the guys that would do it, because the one kid really wants to get this one going and want really wants this one, but then they kind of seem like they don't care about the red one. So I'm wondering if I would be able to fix that one, get it running really well, and then say I'll pay you for the red one. I'll give you, I don't know. 50, 100 bucks, something like that for the red one and you don't have to pay me for repairs. Then they'll ask me, well, what are the repairs? And I'll tell you, you know, an honest, an honest uh, uh, repair, whatever. And then I'll get, if they'll let me, I'll buy the red one from them and uh, drive it around. Nice little moped type motorcycle thingamajig. Take very little gas to run them. They are 19, 1971. I believe this one, this should be a 1971 also. 1970. This is a, this is a year newer. Throttle is really sticky. Like. <laughs> they have very low miles on them. This one's got 3,273. This has 690. So very, very low miles. Especially, if, or even for motorcycles, just very low miles. So, I won't show you the back of them because there's uh, license plates there to protect the, the innocent. <laughs> it has a certain subscriber and subscription says <laughs> you know who you are but if I looked at them I kind of like the, the the 70 better than the 60, 71 but I like this uh, I like the 70 for the style because it's the mufflers all chrome and it's got little this and that but the the 71 is in just better shape the seats in better shape you know, just everything is in, in much better shape. Not a whole lot, but it is in better shape. So this, these are the next things to, to be fixed. Also, that one will be going a little slower than this one. Because that one has an... Uh, I don't know if that's aftermarket or if that's stock. Because that's uh, aluminum. And that's steel. Or is that aluminum too? That sounds like aluminum. They're both aluminum, but I don't know. This one's a larger one, so it won't. It'll have more torque, but it won't have more uh, more speed unless it's geared differently, and they'll be the same. And it's got a centrifugal clutch. It's got your uh, uh, whatever that is down there. I can't remember. It changes the the gearing on it, if I remember right. Like it changes it from high to low. I believe this one should have it too. Yep, it does. Yep, it says high and low. Low, high. So there's low gearing, you know, like town, and then faster roads for high. So there's two different sets of gears there. So I'll start uh, working on it and getting it going here. 
Uh, first thing I'm going to attack, like I always attack for the the very first thing I always attack, carburetor. These carburetors are very gunked up. He said he had a guy work on them, and uh, I get. He said he had a guy hotwire that one because he didn't know where the key was, and this and that, you know, this and that and the other. And then he said he had a guy rebuild the carburetors. He got a rebuild kit and uh, had them rebuilt or something like that. But I don't know. That, that seems fishy to me because, first of all, the gasoline has been in here for more than four years. Because it's just, it's turning back to oil. It's starting to solidify, you know, it's starting to get real hard. Another thing. These carburetors don't look like they've ever been apart. You look at the screws, there's no, you know, it doesn't look like there's ever been a screwdriver in those, those uh, screws. This one has new fuel lines, but it doesn't ever look like it's ever been a, been apart ever. So I don't know what to think. So yeah. Uh, more to come. I'll post this up and then make some repair videos. See you later, YouTube. Bye.